We're here at the Sedona Hummingbird Festival, and downstairs and upstairs in the main area, there are a lot of vendors selling all things hummingbird. Hummingbird art, there's hummingbird feeders, hand-carved hummingbird, like hummingbird beadwork, all kinds of interesting hummingbird things here. And right now we're going around looking and seeing what the vendors have. Hi, we're here with Beth Hawkins, uh, and she is the the big uh, La Jefa, <laughs> the big cheese uh, of the International Hummingbird Society. One of the big attractions at the Sedona Festival is the hummingbird banding demonstration. We saw our friends Sherry L. Williamson and Tom Wood, who were helping out with the birds. Our task first is to identify the species and sex so that we can select the correct size of band. This is an, a, a juvenile male black chin. In part, we can tell by the very pointed outer tail feather, which is similar to the adult female, but he has a very heavy gorget with a little five o'clock shadow, we call it, and an iridescent purple uh, feather in the throat, two of them, which identifies it as, as a juvenile male. We also look along the top of the bill for the fine striations that are present only in juvenile birds. And this bird has about 95% of the striations left in the bill. And as they age into their second year, their striations smooth out from the front to the rear. And uh, by the time they return next year, it will have a fully smooth bill. Another characteristic of a juvenile uh, black chinned hummingbirds is that each of the green feathers has a little buffy color on the edges so it gives it a dingy grayish tannish uh, green appearance so that helps us identify it as a juvenile so first we're going to contain the bird it helps to calm them down and select a, for this juvenile male a 5.6 millimeter band. And they verify the, the number. It is H78563. It's a black chin hummingbird, another juvenile. <coughs> <laughs> no, it's Nano, sorry. You okay, ma'am? Yes, you okay. I hope somebody recorded that. Huh, the sound. Yeah. Well, I close the band to butt it, and now I turn it around to make sure that the buttment is correct and perfectly aligned. This one could use a slight adjustment. <laughs> Probably of a couple hundredths of a millimeter difference. Now it's ready to go on the bird. We're going to weigh the bird next, and so I have to go over here. For that. Yeah, I'll leave it up to you. 3.1 grams. It's a hatch year, male, black chin. The time is 914. 
a wing measure that stops at the shoulder. It's 45 <laughs> millimeters. Female black chin, did you know? 25.5 millimeters. And it's looking like she's got a little bit of 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 a little bit